What's going on everybody? Lisa here. I thought it was about two time that I make a video for winged eyeliner. Yay! Okay, so we're just going to get right to it. I already have all my other makeup on except for my eyeliner, my mascara, and my lips. just realized I don't have my lips on. Okay, so the best way to teach yourself how to do a winged eyeliner, the best product to use is going to be a felt tip liquid eyeliner. It's the easiest to use, the easiest to glide, easiest to manipulate just while you're teaching yourself. My favorite to use after that is going to be a pot eyeliner where you have a little pot of cream eyeliner and then a brush. That's my favorite, but easiest to learn with is the felt tip. And the way that you're going to judge where you do your wing is you're going to follow the very outsides of your eyelid, okay? So I always start with my top line first. Me personally, I start on the outside and work my way in, little short brush strokes, using the very tip of it. And then when I get to the inside corner, I follow that out. And then once I get it probably about halfway, I push down harder. So I get the thicker part of the felt tip base on my lid and then I just go in there and fill it in. Okay, so I have my top baseline. Now, there's a hair on there. Okay, got it off. Whether or not I'm going to take the bottom line halfway in, a quarter of the way in, or all the way in, I do the wing first. Easiest way to find where your natural wing line is, is just follow your bottom line. That's it. That's all you, that's all you want to do. You want to find it. And the way to trace it, I find easiest instead of just putting the palm of your hand on your cheek and trying to, you know, move the use tinsel or eyeliner or whatever because it kind of gets hard to bend your wrist. Put your hand up there because you have a lot more range of motion than just putting it so close to your eye and also you kind of want to pull your eyelid out just a little bit you don't want to you don't want to stretch your eyes out because then you're going to cause wrinkles and then when you pop it back your makeup's going to look a little bit off anyway but you want to make it tight so just kind of barely pull out and then rest your palm on that find your under water line underneath your lashes put your tip there and just do it just follow it there you go. That's going to be a long wing, but that's how you find it. You can make it as long or as short as you want. Then you find the tip of it and you draw it back to your top line. And then you just fill that in. If you want it to get really thick, you can make it really, really thick. Or you can make it really, really thin. And there is a very quick wing. Generally, I like to make my top line a little bit thicker, so I'll come in and usually about mid eyelid, I will fill that in all the way to the tip and make it thicker, just fuller and make my eyes a little bit more intense. I'm not going to do that today. I'm going to leave it just like this. I am going to come in a little bit more on the bottom and using the very tip, I'm not laying it all the way flat and I'm not using it like the tip of a pencil. I'm just have it at a small angle and I'm going to pull it. Oh, we're going to go about halfway in today. And again, see how I still have my eye pulled slightly tight. It just helps any little creases or anything in there. It helps fill them in with that eyeliner because you don't want open spots. And then just darken it. And there you have it. That is the easiest way to do a quick, natural winged eyeliner with a felt tip eyeliner pen. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed and have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys later. Bye.